Hello everyone and welcome back to another round of Stories and Crafts at the Taylor Library. My name is Miss Jen and today is our first craft for the all ages Snow Better Time to Read Winter 2021 craft and story session. So today we'll start off easy with a fun, quick, cute craft that goes along with today's story about mittens. If you haven't checked out our story yet, go to the Taylor Library Facebook page at facebook.com slash Taylor Library Dairy and you'll be able to find our mitten story. And today we have some crafts. If you haven't done so yet, you can still uh, pick up a craft kit. In your kit are almost all the supplies that you'll need to participate in these 10 weeks of virtual crafts and stories. So our first one is mittens, and in your bag, you'll have some construction paper. Take out the light blue one, it should look something like this. And then in your bag, you'll also have a little Ziploc with what looks like a red mitten in it. And it's got some other supplies that we'll use. Last, we'll need a glue stick. And in your bag, there's another bag like this where there's a glue stick. The glue stick may be loose on the bottom, so you might have to look for that one. This glue stick we'll use multiple times throughout the whole series. So once you have your supplies, we're gonna start by taking out our mittens. You should have two mittens. You might even have three. They'll be stuck together, so you have to separate them, but we only need two. One, two. You'll need a piece of string. You'll need some cotton balls and then some foam stickers. So once I have all my supplies out, I'm gonna spread it out so that you can see. I'm gonna start with my mittens and I'm gonna glue them down to my blue background. So if you prefer your background to look like this. You can do it up and down, or if you like the wide frame, you can go side to side like that. So with mittens, the thumbs face each other. So you want the th thumbs to be facing in the same direction so that it looks like hands. And we're gonna glue these down anywhere you want on your piece of paper. it over, cover with glue, oops, big glob. Put your glue down, flip it over, place it about where you want it, and then press down nice and hard on the whole piece. And there's my first mitten. Now remember, our thumbs face each other, so on the other one, we'll flip it over, put some glue on the back, And then I'm gonna place my second mitten, just like that. Make sure you press it down so that it sticks to your paper. And there's our little mittens. And now we get to decorate them. The first thing we're gonna do to decorate is I always lose one of my mittens. So we're gonna try to make it look like they're tied together so that they're easier to find. So the best way to glue down this string that connects our mittens is to take the glue stick, put it somewhere flat or have somebody help you hold it, then take the string and run it all the way through the glue. So the string is gonna be sticky. Just be careful. Once it's covered, place it on one end, maybe in the middle, and then place it on the other end. Oops. And then using your finger, you stick it down to the paper in any design you want. Sometimes you'll have ends that don't have enough glue on it. This side is sticking nice to it, but this end isn't. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more glue to 
to the string and then connect it to my other mitten. just like that. So now it looks like my mittens are tied together. The next piece is I like my mittens to have, you know, fluffy insides. So I'm going to put some cotton on the edge so that it looks like these are fluffy, cozy, nice and warm mittens. So I'm going to take my glue and right on the bottom part of the red mitten, put the glue. You should have four cotton balls. And then we're gonna just stretch out so that it fits about half. Do the same thing on the other side, stretch it out so that it covers the whole bottom part of the mitten. Doesn't that look comfy and cozy? Just like that. And then I'm gonna do the other side. Stretch out your cotton ball. it on half. It might stick to you a little bit, but that's okay. And then stretch out the other one and stick it on the last half. All right. So I'm all done with my glue stick. The last thing I'm going to do is decorate. Now you guys can decorate your mittens any way you'd like. There are crayons also in your bag, so feel free to take out those crayons and color your mittens or we have these really cute foam pieces. Some of them have stick on sides. Actually, none of these ones do. So um, I'm gonna use my glue stick again. And I'm gonna glue these pieces onto my mitten in any design that I like. So I'm just laying them out to see how they'll fit. So now I'm going to take my glue stick back out and glue these pieces down. So glue it directly onto the shapes rather than the mittens because then you won't have globs of glue hanging out. We've got a heart, a star, now I'm going to do a circle. This side has two circles and another heart. All right, what about the other side? Let's do the green heart. Remember, you might have different shapes and that's okay. Square. This is a triangle. A little crescent moon. star. And that is it. So put the glue stick away and you'll be able to see your beautiful mittens. So I hope that you enjoyed this very quick and fun craft. We'll have a new one every Friday for 10 weeks um, and then we'll move into our spring session. So come back in next week and we'll have another craft for you. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this and thank you for joining me.